Hello students welcome this is Sanjay Joseph and you know we are going we are dealing with the chapter polynomials and in polynomials we have come up till you know, cubes and uh, we have learned the formula sum of the cubes has this fact uh, expansion in terms of factorization a cube plus b cube is equal to a plus b into a square minus a b plus b square and a cube minus b cube is equal to a minus b a square plus a b plus b square. Now when you learn something it's very very important to apply. It's very very important to apply. Uh, like suppose you learn a word then there are you should be smart, smart enough to apply it more often. In maths is a subject of application. If you know a formula you need to apply it. And let us see, there are opportunity or sums which lets you use your common sense which formula to be applied here. Like this is same thing three times. So it is what? It is the cube. Cube of 84, right? Plus this is, uh, this is 0.16 cube of, you know, 16. And then this one I can write as 0.84 square minus 0.84 into 0.16 let, let me write it correctly now here then 0.16 plus 0.16 whole square but you know the cube difference has got a factorized formula which will contain this term a cube plus b cube will be a plus b then a square minus a b plus b square and that can be cancelled out because factorized means product form. So product form, numerator and denominator can be cancelled. So what we do is, let me use for better visibility a black pen. Now what will happen? Let us see. 84 plus 0.16. So this is a plus b into. Now this is a square. Okay. Minus a b. That's also okay. plus b square that's also okay so this is so these two two terms are in you know multiplication form and then here same thing we can just copy so now what happens this part and this part can cancel out each other. So we cancel them out. A square minus AB plus B square. A square minus AB plus B square. So this is gone. So we are left with 0 0.84 plus 0 0.6410 0. 0.819 plus 10 0. So that is 1. So the answer is 1. See such a large sum and we are getting answer uh, 1. So that's that's the one part of it now let's go to another part where you have to convert what's given in such a way that uh, these uh, formulas can be applied so these are good sums too you know because it's a combination of two different parts of factorization one is splitting the middle term i'll tell you how x to the power 6 minus 7x cube minus 8 now you have a look I can write this as I can write this as x cube the whole square minus 7 x cube that's right and minus 8 so here x cube let it be equal to a so what will happen this will be a square minus 7 a minus 8 isn't it so now this gets us back to the basics of factorization that is splitting the middle term. What two numbers when multiply will give minus 8 and when we find the difference will give 7. So minus 8 plus 1. So I can write down a square minus 8a plus 1i minus 8. This one cannot be written but that's all some of the kids can don't understand. So I take i common i minus 8 plus 1 so a minus 8. So now this is a minus 8 and a plus 1, right? So now this brings us back to what? Let us see. I have taken x cube as a. So see, just see what I did. I took x cube as a. And then 
So, so this becomes a square minus 7a minus 8. But somebody will take as z. But we should have in our final answer what is given x. No? So a, this becomes a minus 8 becomes x cube minus 8 when I put the value of a here. So this becomes x cube minus 8 and this becomes x cube plus 1 which can be further factorized. Isn't it now? This is sum of two cubes. This one. Have a look. This is x cube minus 2 cube and this is x cube plus 1 cube isn't it so i expand it so this will be x minus 2 x square plus a b plus b square so that's right and this will be x plus 1 x square minus a b x into 1 is x and plus b square so this is what is the complete factorization of this one so let me again see it yeah yeah so that's right so uh, you got to see children uh, i sometimes joke around a boy uh, returned after just first english class and he, he was said that he, he was uh, learning hindi to english and he was said ma hum seek gaye kisi ko agar yahan bulana hoga to kahenge come here to ma ne pucha ki agar wahan bhejna hoga bachcha ne sirf ek hi formula sikha बुलाने को कहते कम हियर पहला दिन लेकिन वो बच्चा बहुत तेज था माँ ने जैसे कहा कि बुलाना होगा तो कहते कम हियर वहाँ भेजना होगा तो अगर सिंपल हम वहाँ जाके बोलेंगे कम हियर सो अप्लीकेशन इज लाइक दैट यू हैव टू यूज योर ब्रेन टू अप्लाई कन्वर्ट इट यहाँ से आप अप्लाई कर सकते हैं क्यूब वाले फार्मूला और यहाँ पर आप स्प्लिटिंग कर सकते हैं तो दैट्स वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट कहीं कहीं पर फार्मूला याद भी आ जाता है कि यहाँ पर कौन फार्मूला लगा लेट एस हैव अ लुक नाउ नाइसली गाइज आई आई विल बी यूजिंग बाई लिंग बिकॉज आई वॉन्ट टू हेल्प आउट ऑल्सो चिल्ड्रन हुटैंड बेटर इन हिंदी ऑल्सो सो लेट सी हियर दिस इज ए क्यूब I can write this is like this x cube minus 3 x square 1 plus 3 1 square x and then plus 1 cube or minus sorry minus 1 cube minus 1 but this 1 x is extra this is not given so but 7 is 8 minus 1 so this is now this is like maha jake bowling come here now you are able to apply the formula here a cube minus 3a square b plus 3ab is 3ab square and minus minus b cube so this will become x x x minus 1 the whole cube and plus this is 8 is 2 cube now again you can for proof put in the formula of a plus b a cube plus b cube a cube plus b cube ko formula ba laga sakte so what will happen a plus b into a plus b into a square minus a b plus b square Saval. so this is x plus 1 right and this will be x square minus 2x plus 1 this will be minus 2x minus plus 2 and plus sorry 4 so now what will happen let us see x plus 1 x square minus 2x from here and minus 2x from here this is minus 4x now this is 2 plus 1 3 and plus 4 how much 2 plus three, uh, 7 so that's all so good so try to apply and you know it is like learning if you learn one word you try to apply it all the time nice see you